Hi, my name is Robin Alomar. I was at the acting program at TFS, class of 2017. <laughs> what inspires me, honestly, is life, what is going on um, in the world, the world in its current state. You know, I feel that you can find inspiration in people and situations and in culture. So, you know, that's what's really been inspiring me recently. My experience at Toronto Film School was honestly so much fun. I love going to school every day. It just felt really, really good. And you were always in such a, such a safe environment. You know, you could be as vulnerable as you needed to be and as you wanted to be. And um, yeah, and I also have like lifelong friends that I made there. So Toronto Film School was a great experience. What motivates me to keep going at difficult times, honestly, is myself. I feel like you really, you have to believe in yourself. And when I get down on myself, I check myself, <laughs> I take a deep breath, and I remember who I am, for real. You have to, you have to believe in yourself because if you don't, then who is? You know what I mean? So you have to be your own cheerleader. You have to know that, you know, you are that person and that you got this. I ended up booking the role for Utopia Falls, uh, first through a self-tape, and I was actually not about to do it that day because Uber was messed up and I couldn't get to my destination, um, but I'm happy I did the audition. And then I didn't hear back for like a month, I think. And then I had two or three callbacks um, after that. And one of them was a dance callback and the two other ones um, were, were Skype calls and uh, acting auditions. And I was so nervous <laughs> and I was freaking out, especially for the dancing. Um, but then I got the call that I got it and I flipped out because I've been waiting for that call, I feel like for so long. And, and I was just really, really happy. And then so I flew back to Toronto because um, I was in LA at the time. And yeah, I started filming the show. <laughs> uh, so I do a couple of things to get into character. Uh, so before we even start filming, I actually create a journal for my character. Um, and I customize it to uh, who she is or who they are. And, um, you know, I write down things about their family or things that they like, how they feel about the world, because I feel like um, when you film a show, you can just get the script so last minute that sometimes you don't always have time to be able to fully prep and break things down. So I feel like that keeps me always zoned in character. I always know who, who I am at core. Um, but when I am on set, um, Honestly, I take my deep breaths. Um, I get into Aaliyah's state of mind. I walk around the set for a bit um, as, as my character, and I try to just to be the most present as possible and always, always, always listening to whoever that I'm working with in the scene. So um, my two favorite things that I've worked on um, are definitely Utopia Falls. Um, that's definitely my favorite. And another thing that I'm really proud of is a small project I worked on actually called Baldwin Beauty. Um, with the director Thembi Banks. That was an incredible uh, set to be on. It was all women of color, um, all writers of color. It was, the director was a woman of color. It was just, it was really powerful to be on set and to be around that. I, I love that. What was it like working on a bigger set? I'm so happy somebody asked me that. It was insane. Um, I'm still very new um, to this, honestly, and I'm so fortunate and thankful, um, but working on a big set was a really big change. Um, it was amazing though, honestly, like it really made everything feel so real and so like authentic and so, and so it really made you feel like you were in this sci-fi world. Um, but it was, you know, especially in the beginning, it was definitely, it was definitely nerve wracking. Um, you know, especially coming into it as, you know, a little bit less experienced than some of like the older actors that were on there, even some of the other main cast. Um, but I got used to it pretty quick and, and that set became my home. <laughs> my biggest takeaway from TFS is honestly, listen to all of your teachers and everything that they have to teach you. Um, because trust me, it is going to help you. It really, really is. I can think of, you know, even breathing exercises that I learned at TFS that I still use now going into auditions and um, like right when I'm on set. So honestly, listen to what all of your teachers have to say and absorb everything. Um, and something else that I also um, learned from uh, TFS is work with as many different people there as you can. You know what I mean? That is so, that is so, so good because you get to learn how to react off of other people and uh, learn how to work with different types of actors. And so that was a really, really cool thing that I took away from uh, Toronto Film School. My biggest advice to future actors and students is to always believe in yourself. 
for real no matter what. You need to always be visualizing who you wanna be in, in your head. And to always work your ass off because hard work always pays off. And to know that your dreams and your goals are absolutely valid and that we need content from so many different voices.